Today we have a 2013 Toyota Prius and uh, we're gonna change the spark plugs. And if you have seen these, haven't seen these before, you gotta pull the engine cover off. Of course, somebody broke that off, but I'm gonna pull the engine cover off. Okay, it just pops up like that. And then you look back here, it looks really easy, except because of the space, you because of the space here, you cannot get a tool in there to unscrew the spark plug and get it out. So what we're gonna have to do in order to do that is pull this wiper cowling piece out of here, okay? So what we have to start with is pulling off the wiper arms. We're gonna start here, here, okay? And then we're gonna pull this piece out, okay? So let's start with the wiper arms and go from there. Okay, we're gonna remove this nut with a 14 millimeter socket. Okay. And this one. Okay, now these just pull up, okay? So we're gonna just wiggle them off and that whole wiper arm should come off of there. Push down and it should pop right up just like that, okay? Okay, now we're gonna remove this wiper blade. Uh, so the first thing we're gonna do is uh, pop that cover off. Um, I lost my tool. Just like that, pop it off. And once again, we'll use 14, okay, 14's off of there, same thing, wiggle it, push down and wiggle it, and it should pop right up just like that. Okay, now that we got both wiper arms off, we gotta pull this piece, this whole big long piece out of here, okay? We can take this off if you want, but it doesn't really make a difference at the moment uh, for anything. Each piece, here has a little attaching clip, okay? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, okay? Now, I'm just gonna put a tool here and just pop it up like that, okay? Just like that. Popped up. Okay, now I get this out of here. Forgot about this one. Okay, I guess I gotta pull that off. Okay. one I'll move over to the other side Got this one okay take that one out now this will come off just like that okay now we got to take the wiper motor out so those two bolts that bolt and the plug right there Okay, there's one, there's two, and that's a 10 millimeter, three. All right, let's see. Okay, now the three bolts are out. We're going to unplug this. There's a button at the bottom, uh, back, right? Push, see the, see the clip there? You just push it, push it, push it, and pull it out. That's it, just like that. Push, pull, all right? Now, there's a pushing in the back, slides into there. So we're gonna lift up the motor like this and we're gonna slide it out to the left, okay? Um, there's one more bolt I forgot, right here. Okay, 
So four bolts, I'm sorry. There's one right there. Okay. Now, pull it to the left. It's coming out. There we go. Okay. Now, there's a clip here. Pulling the wiring harness on. I usually just pop them off. Okay, now we got the wiper motor out of the way. Now we have to take this bracket and then we're gonna take this whole cowling out, this black cowling here, and you can see all the bolts. There's one there, one there, one there, right? And you just keep going across, you see them, one there, one there, one there, and then the two at the end there, all right? And then this piece in the middle here just kind of pops in, okay? After all of that, look how much room you got. Now you can do the spark plugs. Once again, 10 millimeter. All right, all the coils, all four of them held in by 10 millimeter, okay? Okay, now we are going to pull the spark plugs and I use this, these spark plugs are 14 millimeter. They're not the standard 5.8, so 14 millimeter spark plug socket, a, uh, a six inch extension, and a ratchet. Put it down in there. And go ahead and loosen the plug. Now, you don't want to do this on a hot engine because aluminum blocks will strip if you do it on a hot, hot engine. After you take all four out, you can put new all four new ones in and reverse everything from the removal and put it all back together. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel.